everybody, it's Angie, Treasured Vintage. I had a request to do a video about organizing my jewelry, and I think that um, I will try to do that today and also show you my office space. Uh, this is a converted bedroom into an office. This is where all the magic of Etsy happens, right here at this desk. Um, a lot of times... My husband is right here at this desk. And there's my printer. Various things there. Here's the things that I will, that I have taken pictures of and I'm getting ready to list. I put in this box here. There's my laptop, my MacBook. This is my scale. So for the organization, Whoa, you weren't expecting that, I bet. <laughs> My husband built this for me. It's a giant cupboard and shelving unit. Um, I really have to take everything off of that top shelf because it's totally not organized. Neither is the, the, the top, the very top. But what we have is... This area right here is all listed, and from here down is not listed, but organized. And then we have some listed things in, in the cabinets that I'll show you. Um, we have listed things in some boxes that I'll show you. And I have a drawer where I keep some listed things. Um... They're mostly bigger necklaces, um, and they're laid in there carefully. I mean, they're not in there scratching each other up. I always make sure I lay them in there, and I don't mess with them after that. But they are all listed, as is this box of things here, all listed. And now, the things in boxes are most are necklaces for the most part and then I have all these that are listed in this wooden box this is my Napier collection and there <laughs> um, okay so over here what I do is I buy these at Hobby Lobby and I was in there the other day and I see that they the prices have gone up on these they used to be a dollar ninety nine. Now they are two ninety nine, I think. Um, but what I do is, um, I don't I don't leave things in piles. Normally, I I put them in boxes right away, by color, by item. Like this is mostly silver, as you can see, and I think it's mostly necklaces, and that would be how I. Do my pre-listed items. This is big giant pendants. Whoa, big giant pendant necklaces. Um, and this is gold tone pins with pearls and such which I think I already showed you that in a video but what I'm uh, planning on doing is going through some of these boxes on videos with you um, like my Avon uh, maybe my Trafari again I think I've already shown that here's a giant box of pearls all pearl things um, big box of pearl not all the pearls that I have, but I think most of those are necklaces and bracelets. Um, we have here uh, boxes. The most boxes I have are of earrings, probably. <laughs> but what I want to do, like I said, is show you um, things that I, that, that I don't have listed. But for the things that I do have listed... Here is how I do it. Um, this is all earrings. And the way that I organize them is uh, 
I will put them by color usually. This is this is rings over here, excuse me. I have rings over here and I have earrings here and they are mixed up. They are not uh, all, you know, uh, pierced here and clip here. They're mixed up, but they're they're mostly by color. So, and I I don't know how, but I usually uh, it's very very um it's it's not often at all like maybe once or twice I have not been able to find something but um I just know I just know how it's organized now I might put the Christmas things together or I might put like I have some Christmas things in here but I also have green in here um these earrings are you know similar in color like I said. And then over here I have necklaces. Um, I tried, like I said, to put the silver tone and the gold tone together. Uh, the like items, like the pearly ones in here, the ones with pearls, um, just the gold tone ones, maybe with cabochons or beads. And we have the silver tone ones. And Just, uh, they're all necklaces. These are all bracelets. And they are, they're arranged in, in the same way, by, by color or by style. Over here, this is empty. I need to, need to fill that up sometime. These might have a couple little things in here, but for the most part, they're empty. And this, by the way, these came out of my dad's garage. All these things here, they were tool, you know, they're tool um, organizers or hardware organizers for uh, a garage or, you know, for your nuts and bolts and things. That's what I use. Anyway, um, over here we have the brooches. So this is all the brooches that are listed. And, and up here are some jewelry sets, some bigger items that wouldn't fit like this bracelet. It didn't fit with the other bracelets. So this is kind of like a bigger storage area for the catch-all things that are big. Like this giant uh, Judith Liebner, I think is, it is, or something. Um, pendant necklace or pillbox thing and then up here at the top I have some men's accessories cufflinks and whatnot so let me see what else oh okay let's look in the cabinet now this stuff is mostly listed uh, it's not very very organized but behind here are hats and scarves here I have my picture frames and in here is just miscellaneous. Um, here's my Christmas ornaments. And most of my Christmas things are over here. There's a Valentine girl back there. Um, just some things that I can lay flat in here. Um, yeah, like I said, it's not real organized. And in here, I don't think there's much in there that's listed, but but belts back in the corner there. Um, and this, that's listed. This is listed. This is listed. So, yeah, here and there, there's things listed. This is listed. Um, so, yeah, that's that shelf. It all needs redone. It all needs reorganized. But now down in here, I have a Tupperware thing of like bigger bangle bracelets that are listed. And by the way, what's, why, why won't someone buy that? I think that's beautiful. I think that would be like for a wedding or a prom. I mean, I know it's gaudy and everything, but I just think it's so, I think it's so pretty. Look at the, like the, I don't know what you call that, embossing or whatever on there. And I don't know. I like that, and it doesn't sell. I'm going to do a video of things that I think should be sold, and they're not yet. 
Um, and this, isn't this cute? Some, for something blue, it's adorable. So there's all those that are listed. Um, this is the cloisonne that uh, someone wants to purchase, perhaps, that I took out of my cloisonne box. It's just waiting for her to get back to me. And here is, there's my damascene little collection that I have. Um, here is a little box of totally crystal things. Look at that sparkle. Isn't that beautiful? I enjoy just looking at that stuff. So, so pretty. And it's what, what else makes it special is the pin set beads. This is called pin set and um, the way they are put in there. But isn't that gorgeous? Look at the colors flying off of that. Wow. Don't know why that's not worth a whole lot more than it is. But that's my crystal stuff. Oh, gee. Oh, gee. Doing this with one hand is not the best. And I'm sorry if the... I'm really sorry if the camera's jiggling around. I didn't even think of that. It's probably going all over the place. So, down in the bottom here is just a mishmash of things. These are all vintage belt buckles that I was going to list that I haven't. And this is a tong thing. Just, just, yeah, I, it's just a mess in here. But at least it's behind the door. This is all my patriotic jewelry. That's probably not all of it, but some of it that I have in this little pouch. All patriotic stuff. This is my craft lot bag. This is my resell lot jewelry bag. Down here's a container with all kinds of other stuff <laughs> cards wow i'm going down a rabbit trail here it's not really organization anymore is it <laughs> i love these round cards though round playing cards aren't they cool okay okay back to the organization so i have uh things in here i have a bag of buttons but you get the picture. It's just a, uh, it's just basically storage, and uh, some some little collections down in there. This is my gold and silver that I have not gotten uh, tested yet, or um, I want to take it to scrap. And over here we have chains that I use um, if I need to put a pendant. Find, find a chain for a pendant. These are all over here, and in here, and in here, and in here. And then we have some cleaning supplies down in here. Oh, uh, let's see. Anything else? Here's my collection of Shelties that for the most part, people have gifted me uh, or, or painted for me or, you know, been so kind to, to gift me. Um, here's my couple books. Here's a couple books down here. Um, let's see. My paper down there. My beautiful... I just had that light on. It's not a very good place for that light. I had it on because I wanted all the light I could get for doing this video. But there's my beautiful Kathleen picture. Kathleen Riggs painted that for me. Not for me, but she painted it. And the Don Maserati uh, gift, which is a, a gorgeous, just a gorgeous Christmas tree that stays up there all the time. 
on. There's my clock. And I, I was going to list that, but I didn't. I love the building. I love the picture. Um, yeah, I guess that's it. Um, I'm probably forgetting something, but I want to do a video next uh, on uh, or some random jewelry boxes and show you that jewelry up close. Oh, I just got a, a sale. So I better go and get that ready and get it in the mailbox. And I will see you guys later. This is what Tanya made me. Tanya made me that. And I'll leave you with this because that's true. Okay, bye for now. Have a great day. I hope you enjoyed this video. And please like and subscribe. Leave a comment. Uh, it helps with the, the video, with my channel. Thanks so much. And bye from snowy Pennsylvania.